Hope everyone's having a very nice Saturday evening or early Sunday morning. I'm meteorologist Jack Griffin with your Weather Now video forecast update. We have a, some showers and a little rumbles of thunder moving through the area this evening. And uh, during the overnight hours, we're expecting mainly cloudy skies. But by the time we get to around 4 or so in the morning, we might see additional isolated showers and storms. And that will be along and ahead of the cold front that we're expecting to be moving through at that time. The cold front this evening, though, will be pushing through Minnesota, going into Iowa, Missouri, Nebraska, and Kansas. And the storms along that will likely be uh, pretty strong to severe. But when it gets into our area during the morning, tomorrow morning, notice how the uh, rain showers really just dissipate over our area. So we're expecting mainly scattered showers and a few rumbles of thunder. The band kind of reintensifies over Indiana, but then at that point, it's already past us. So really just looking at some spotty showers and storms for the first part of the day tomorrow before clearing skies will occur for the second part of the day tomorrow. And that will mean that um, going into the rest of the forecast, things will be actually pretty nice. So we're not expecting a lot of rain with this system. In fact, uh, within the next uh, couple of days, we're really just talking about tomorrow being the chance for rain on the seven day forecast. Maybe only a quarter of an inch is possible. So not a whole lot of rain is expected. The big thing will be the temperature dip that you'll be able to see over the next coming days and the dew point dip as well. So it's going to become much more comfortable and less muggy around the area, really in the near term, as early as Monday, um, once that front passes through. So let's time things out here. By uh, tonight, we are expecting there to be a mainly cloudy skies, can't rule out an isolated shower or storm, but the best chances you can see as this front moves through during the late morning, early afternoon, will be the chances for showers and storms then. By around four o'clock or so, that front is already pushed off well into Indiana, and so clearing skies will then occur after that point, and then the rest of the forecast does look very nice. So going into the uh, overnight hours tonight, we're expecting mainly cloudy skies with an isolated shower storm. We'll have 64 degrees, and then going into the day tomorrow, we'll be talking about uh, really temperatures um, right where they were today, maybe a little bit cooler, but um, you're going to notice the wind shift. The winds will turn out of the west-northwest once the front passes by, and that will signal that um, things will begin to cool down for the rest of the week. If you want to check out the forecast for the seven days, seven day forecast that's right below in the seven day forecast video. If anything needs to be changed, I'll make sure to update it right away. But we're basically just looking at some isolated showers and storms pushing through the area this evening with more of those showers and storms expected in the forecast uh, for tomorrow morning. Hope everyone has a very nice rest of your Saturday or early Sunday morning.